Hmm. Oh, good morning, Silver. Do you know what today is? Um, Wednesday? No, actually, it's Thursday. Oh, okay. What's today? Today is the day we finally get married! What? That's right, today is the day we finally get married! I'm so excited to live with you uh, forever, and I am a little scared at the same time, but I don't care! Um, alright, I gotta go get ready. Alright, I'll see you later. Hey, uh, Dad, where are you? I heard you scream. What's your problem? Charmy, it's horrible. Today is the day that me and Blaze actually finally get married, and I forgot! Oh no, that's terrible. That's what I'm saying. But now... <sighs> oh. Ah. I don't know what to do. I haven't even sent out invitations. I didn't even let anyone know what it was today. And I I don't even remember where the engagement ring I gave her was. I don't know where it is. Oh, today is the worst day of my life. Well, maybe I can help. Charmy, there's no way you can send out invitations. Not on my own. Vector! And bring XPO. <laughs> yeah, what's up? Ouch. Yeah, what up? Well, you see, it sucks. See, today is the day that, you know, my mom and dad finally get married, and, uh, he kind of forgot. Oh, well, that's just terrible. Yeah, that sucks. And I was wondering, um, see, I'm gonna go try to get my mom ready for it, so, um, maybe you can, um, you know, um, send out some invitations, please, and maybe help us find a replacement engagement ring. Hold on, I think I have an idea on a replacement engagement ring. <sighs> Behold, I have a nice little gem right here. May not be as cool as an engagement ring, but it's, well, pretty pretty. Yeah, it is. Look at it, Dad. Mm, I suppose it is. Yeah, alright. But you guys are really okay with helping me? Of course, dude. What are friends and roommates for, I suppose? Thank you guys so much. You don't know how much this means to me. Alright, then. What are we waiting for? Let's go send out some invitations. Let's be all. It's gonna be a nice little montage, too. With montage music and everything. That's nice, I suppose. Alright, Charmy. You go get your mother ready, and I'm gonna stay here and get ready, too. Alright, Mom! Alright. Oh, I'm praying to God that they get those invitations out. Yeah, what's up? Wanna come to a wedding? Okay, sure. Alright, cool! I wanna go. Alright, Sonic, um, let's go shopping to make me look good. Uh. Do you hear something? Uh-huh. What's up there? <laughs> wanna go to a wedding? Okay, sure. Mm -hmm. Affirmative. Ciao! Okay. Oh. Wanna go to a wedding? Sure, okay. Okay. Bored. Me too. Wait, what the heck? Hello. Whoa! Wanna go to a wedding? Alright, sure. Okay. Huh. Wanna go to a wedding? Sure, whatever. Hey! Down here! Wanna go to a wedding? Sure, okay. Okay! <sighs> Uh, you want to go to a wedding? Yeah. All right, let's go. Oh, I'm excited because I'm going to get married today, but I'm also so nervous. I don't know if I can do this. No, I can. I mean, sure, it's going to probably change your life forever. Oh. Uh, okay, we invited everyone we possibly could, and no... And now they're all here. Um, outside. Mm-hmm. Oh, good, I, I think. Uh, let me go check. 
All right, let's just check out. Holy Schwarzenegger! Uh, I. Uh. What's wrong? You seem upset. No, I'm just not upset. It's just that you invited everyone we knew. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I thought that's what you would probably want. I mean, I know, it's nice and all, it's not like I didn't want them to come, but... God, I didn't expect so many people. I'm gonna have a heart attack. Oh, I'm having a panic attack. Oh... Just go relax, take a sip of water, and calm down. Okay. Thank you. I'm gonna go. Alright. Can I check up on Blaze for me? Okay. Okay, I just need to relax. Relax, that's all. All I need to do is relax. Relax, 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 relax. Oh, I don't know. Oh, God. Uh, 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 oh, God. I'm having a panic attack. Oh. How are you doing, Miss Blaze? Doing rather quite well. Excited to get married, I presume? Well, yes, but to tell you the truth, I'm a little nervous. I get it. It's understandable. Doing something that never thought would actually happen, but, you know, when it finally actually happens, you know, get kind of, you know, nervous about it. That I understand. You know, you see, I have a lot of things I want to do in my life, but I'm not sure if I can because I'm too nervous. Then when I finally do it, well, I get nervous about it. Well, what I'm trying to say is that it may be nervousing, and it may be you know, earth-shattering, but, you know, you only get one chance to do it, and you might as well not try to blow it. Well, I suppose that is correct. Thank you. Hey, no problem. What are roommates for? Did we already say that? Probably, but it was cooler when you said it. Well, thank you. Well, everyone's here. Shall we go? I suppose so. Oh man, who thought I actually get to be the ring holder? Well, I guess in this case the gem holder, because we don't have a ring. But that's okay. Oh boy, it's starting! I know. Kinda awkward when you don't have a wedding dress on. Oh, well, uh, couldn't find one, I suppose, maybe. Hmm, probably. I heard there was supposed to be like 70 weddings today, so it makes sense. 70? No wonder they probably couldn't find one, most likely. Question from the audience? Yes. Where's Silver? <laughs> oh shoot, now I'm just realizing he's gone. Where is he? What if he doesn't want to marry me? Don't think that. Um, wait here, Mom. I'm gonna go find him. Dad? Where are you? <sighs> Dad? What's wrong? Charmy, I don't know if I can do this. I mean, I want to marry her, but it's just so terrifying, you know? I mean, I mean, this is gonna, like, change my life forever, and I just not know if I'm ready for that. I mean, sure, I already lived with her for a while, but it was already terrifying enough when I proposed to her. Sure, it was very happy and nice of me to do, but I just don't know if I can do it. <laughs> Dad. <laughs> yeah. You are brave, strong, have mind-moving powers, and best of all, you're a very caring person, and I know you better than anyone else. You may have only been my dad for about half a year, but that doesn't change the fact that I think you're personally the best dad ever. No offense to Sonic and his children. Bowl around, I never had a family, but now I have you. Sure, anyone could have just adopted me, but it took a while for that to happen, but you chose me. And right now, if you choose wrongly and don't go out there, well, you know what happens. But right now, you need to make the big decision. You need to go out there and marry her. Don't make the same mistakes that I use make. I make some very plenty mistakes back then, annoying Vector to death, just becoming kind of a nuisance. 
But now I've learned, and I've grown up, matured. But now you need to make good choices and go out there. I don't know if any of thing I'm saying makes sense, but I hope it, it can for you anyway. My point across is that, Dad, I love you, man, and, well, you, I, I can't speak. See, don't make mistakes, man. You gotta go out there and marry her, okay? That's all I'm really gonna say. But, I love you, okay? No matter what you do, but... You are amazing, Dad. Thank you, Charmy. Oh, you are the best son a hedgehog like me can un can ever have. No problem, Dad. Now, isn't there something you're supposed to be doing? Hugging you? Uh, no. Um, what am I supposed to be doing? Right, marriage. Uh, come on, we gotta go. All right, he's coming. He's here. Well, it's about time. Jeez. <sighs> Alright. I'm here. <sighs> okay, then. Now, I know there's probably supposed to be a whole speech that I'm supposed to say, but I don't really know most of it because I'm only six years old and I've never been to a wedding. So I guess I uh, shall cut to the chase. Blaze, a.k.a. my mom, will you take Silver the Hedgehog, a.k.a. my dad, to be your husband? Well, uh, <clears throat> I do. And Silver, aka my dad, do you take Blaze, aka my mom, to be your wife? I... God, he's getting cold feet again. Silver, if you don't want to say it, it's okay. I understand. No. Blaze... You are the most perfect, most beautiful woman I have ever met. And I don't think I can ever think of anyone else I ever want to spend my life with. You're precious, talented. I hear you sing in the shower sometimes, so I kind of jam off to your singing. And most importantly, you're very precious to me. And I don't ever want to lose you. Losing you would basically mean I have nothing to live for, honestly. Except raising my kid. But I don't think I can ever raise a kid on my own. I would need you. It's basically what I'm trying to say is, Blaze, is that I love you, and... I want to marry you. And I want to grow old with you. I want to do everything with you. Because... I don't ever want to leave you. I love you, Blaze. <laughs> oh, oh, Blaze, don't cry. <laughs> I'm not crying. It's just tears of joy. So, is that a yes? I do. I very much do. And before you pronounce this man and wife, may I have this? Since I couldn't find your engagement ring, I wanted to get you this. Oh my gosh, it's a little pink gem. So cute. Thank SBO for giving it to me. No problem, man. Well then, by the power invested in me, I'm waiting to say this, man. I pronounce you two, Hedgehog and Cat. I love you, Blaze. I love you too, Silver. Not tears of joy again, no! Just beautiful, man. Just so, oh, so beautiful. God, I'm crying! <laughs> I'm so happy! Well, that was... relieving, I suppose. Agreed, Silver. Absolutely agree. Oh, mm. I love you. I love you too, Silver. <laughs>